Okay, so PTCP is here up in Bedford at another job centre plus that I found. It took me a while to find this one. This one's like tucked right up out of the way. Um, so yeah, it's a bit odd. I'm not really sure where the entrance for it is. But um, yeah, we're going to head down this way and have a look. I'm feeling this down here. And the other side here, maybe. So we've got the... Uh, Windows here, but it looks empty. It's very empty. Looks like you have a job center I haven't called and given them a heads up. We'll see, we'll see how it goes. going on with that there. That blocked off the road over there. Yes. How are you doing, mate? You right? Videos are not allowed. Videos are not allowed inside. What do you mean? Camera. It's a phone. Yeah, buddy. You all right? You got an appointment? No, no, just come to have a look. You come to have a look? Yeah. Oh, okay. So it's um, like you've got posters now on the wall, so I've come to have a look at um, If you're in this job centre here, uh -huh. um, you only have to have appointments to walk in. Because if you want to go, if you have any information about any of our services or anything like that, mm -hmm. Bromham Road is where we set all our most of our. Um, oh, okay. Here is just like appointments with our customers. So why do you have information on the yeah, walls for the public? Just, that's here. It's like yeah, a public yeah, area. Well, here. Well, well, but you see, yeah. apart from here, like this. Yeah, area. anywhere that's got public information, I like yeah, see you got computers there for the public to come and do job yeah. searches. Yeah, so yeah, anywhere that's publicly jobs. accessible. Yeah, the here, you got yeah. Jobs here. Anywhere that's publicly accessible, yeah. that's the only okay. place I want to go. And another thing I need to say as well. Um, are you recording? Pardon? Did you ask your question? Are you recording? Does, does it matter if I'm recording? Yeah, it's only because the public building are off. Which we can't have anyone yeah, recording. Yeah, public meeting. building, you can. Yeah. Um, but I'm just saying, what I'm saying is, here, mm -hmm. we're not, it's a government building. Mm -hmm. And because of the government building, we don't allow anyone like this. To, and I don't give you any permission like that to record. Um, do you understand where you're coming from? No. You don't? No. Okay. Would you like to see a memo that I have in my pocket from okay. the DWP? From, from the DWP themselves? Right. Do you Let want to me, see it? Hold on, hold on one sec. I mean, this I'm memo not, can... I'm not, I'm not, I know, but I'm just saying this memo can settle the whole debate before we go any okay, further. Okay. But what I'm saying is, obviously, normally what we do... Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you, if you let me finish, what we normally do is, once we have a customer or anyone coming in, mm -hmm. we just ask them for an appointment. You do? Yes. Or you and your colleagues? Yeah. Because we always so, do... Just to, just to I'm, I'm pretty sure that G4S are not contracted to ask, no, uh, to interact with claimants, whether no, their name, if they got an appointment. And I, I, I have that in writing. Okay, that's fine. But what so I'm you're breaching GDPR there. Okay, that's, that's fine. But what I'm saying is we okay. normally, what we do here... Yeah, yeah. Yeah, is we... Can you just leave No, because, I mean, you're admitting stuff on camera for evidence right now. I mean, you've just admitted a GDPR breach no, on camera. No, but what I'm saying so, is we normally ask yeah. customers. We need to know, we need to, um, at a point of contact with customers, we need to know what... Claimant, reason, not customer. Yeah, okay, claim what they're here for. Mm -hmm. So establish what the reason why they're here. Okay. I've told you that. I'm going okay. to have a look around. Okay, so listen, cool. one second. Right. So, if I'm going to be asked, I need to know why, what you're here for. You haven't yeah. got a point in the hands of why. Mm -hmm. My colleague here asked you if you're recording, and you said you are. I didn't. Okay. So, because I was walking that time. Yeah, no, you just told me I can't record. I never said I'm recording. Okay, so that's what we have here. We've, no, we yeah. we've been told that, obviously, okay. if we, you know, you can't just come in without appointments, because that's what we've been told from... But you I, mean, to manage, I, problem, I, I, I had a look on the way in. Yep. All job centres that are strictly appointment only mm -hmm. say so on the front of the building as you okay. come in, appointment only. Um, I've, I go to many job centres. This one has no information on the outside saying this is an appointment only building. Yes. <coughs> Was it? Yes. That one says appointment only. Ah, uh, okay, yeah, I'm right. I missed that one. I was, I was looking at that. I forgot covered up there. But. Do you understand where I'm coming from now? Not really, because it's still public information. Hi, huh. hey, buddy. Is that a works phone? What's your name? Raj. Your business name. Thank you, Raj. I'll do a freedom of information request for that one. But, um, yeah, so really what I want to do is just film this information on the wall. Was all, uh, any 
recording with the jobs yes. offered. That's not a yeah. problem. Exactly, that's all I came to do. As far as you know, recording us. Yeah. That would be great. But I mean, okay? if, if you, you approach me and you're on if camera... You, if you please, we, we're not watching you on the camera. Camera is much over at the moment, but if you will be able just to, to film us, OK? OK. You. Um, if you could turn all your CCTV off then while I'm in the building, that would be great. Why should we do that? Because she's asked me not to record you, so I'll just ask her the same courtesy. A phone. This is for public. Oh. What do you mean for public? That, that, these cameras here, we don't yeah. have control over that. You don't know that, any. The, the DWP do. That's right. So we can't just switch yeah, yeah. it off just like that. Well, you said so. okay. Well, if the DWP want to turn the cameras off, then, I'll, then uh, I won't film you. Well, you can request that by the manager if you want to. Press uh, that. They don't mind to ask the manager to see. We're not talking with that. I'm definitely on the list. Uh, when you did mention that you have been here, they will still see you. So access to work. Is there enough, is there that, one. that one's turned around, which is weird. Okay. I've never seen that before either. So this one's also out of date. That's from last week. That should have been updated first thing this morning. Uh, same information that they have over at the uh, other one. Uh, and uh, they have a sign in, but they've actually got the GDPR compliant one on that side, so you can't see people's signatures. That's correct. There we go. See, that's actually the first job centre that I've been to that has that. Okay. Every other job centre I have just have the appointment list and sign in book just wide oh, open. With it. Be outside. Yeah. Confidential exactly. Be outside. It shouldn't, should it? No, it should be covered like that. You should have the GDPR okay. compliant no, folder. So that's really, really good. Really good. Okay. I've also noticed, like, as I walk to the entrance going down the windows, you can't see any computer screens from like workers and stuff, which is really good. Again, you don't get that at a lot of job centres. So I would say this job centre is really well laid out. You guys are doing great with GDPR. Um, the only issue is, like, obviously, people are allowed to film in a public place. So that would be it. So, uh, jobs at Burger King, Beef Eater, Mem Recruitment. Toyota. Royal Marine Commando. Tour Raj, are you the manager on duty? For the front of us, yes. Yes, yeah. Um, so, as your security guard was saying to me when I came in, he was saying that the security G4S would ask if somebody has an appointment, their name and stuff like that. They, wouldn't, they wouldn't ask the name. They would ask if the person's what got an appointment. Okay. They check the appointment time, and then if they are within a few minutes, and then of they the send them over to you. Then there's an all for me. Okay, okay, that's cool. Yeah, I was just, I was just saying to the security lady, like, I really like that you've got the uh, GDPR are compliant. You, are you me? I really like that you've got the GDPR compliant sign in book there with the sheets over it. Not a lot of job centres have that. So I was actually going to say you're doing really well. well thank you. The only thing issue is uh, you did take a photo of me on your personal device. Yeah. Are, you, are, you, um, are you filming me? Yes, at the moment, if, I yeah. if I end up on um, YouTube, you told mm. you. Pardon? If you, if, I end, if you end up on YouTube, what? If I end up on YouTube, so are you. Okay, it's fine. I'm already on YouTube, but okay. No, no worries. <laughs> it's a bit of a normal. Cheers, Ross. I mean, you can, though, it's a public place. You can, but you cannot record individual. You shouldn't record individual without well, our permission. Record. I mean, I just point it like. We ask you, you we, my colleague asks, I do not wish to stop recording. recording. Mm -hmm. Then you can't record us. I can, you're in a public place. No, no. Yeah. We can refuse to be recorded. No. Yes. So can, can I ask, I can, I, can, I, can I make you turn the cameras off in here? No, because they're for security reasons. So mine's for security reasons as well. I, I video every interaction but everywhere I go. We, we, our guidance has said that you can record, yeah. but you can't record us because we refuse to be recorded. No, it says you can say that. So you, you can't I can. put us on, like, you know, like you know, my colleague said, Facebook or any of the uh, Twitter or mm, whatever. The baseball. The media. I mean, if you talk to somebody holding a camera in a public no, place. You'll find that we're, we're, there was such a great big controversy you know, about it that you can record, yeah. but not the... the 
Yeah. Okay. You have to well, I, I, I don't give permission to be recorded in here, well, but your CCTV remains on, doesn't it? Yeah, you can uh, make so. that up with the legislator. Raj, I'll see you tomorrow. Uh, yes. You were at Brum Road. There we go. But yeah, so what you were saying about putting me on YouTube, going back to that, because you've taken a photo of me whilst you're on working time, you've done that as part of the DWP organisation. If you were to post me on YouTube, you and the DWP would be liable for a huge breach of GDPR. Um, and I mean, the fines are in the millions for it, especially for an organisation as large as this, because it's part of the government. The fines would be astronomical. Your job would be in jeopardy. Um, it, I wouldn't recommend it. Like I said, I am going to do a freedom of information request for that, so make sure you don't delete it. That is a formal request not to delete that and, and you, under you know GDPR. That I, would, I took a picture, yes? Yes. Just I saw, that's you all know, we are recording you as well. Okay, thank okay. you. Appreciate that. Just you know. Yeah, cool. Uh, see, that's the thing. Like, I can't stop him from doing that. Like, you can't stop me from doing it. Yeah, his reasons are different to yours. No. I come to have a look around and I like to record just in case anything happens. I get so assaulted sometimes. So do you find a job that you, you know, interests you? Yeah, a few, yeah. Well, not, not personally me, but some of my uh, viewers, yeah, maybe. But, um, but yeah, just uh, just want to give you advice on that and make, make sure you don't delete that photo that you took on your camera, on your phone. I don't uh, take a picture. Well, Which you can prove, obviously, can't you? Well, I mean, where's the nearest yeah, camera? You, that camera will show that you took either. That camera will show that you took a picture and this really? will show that you really? took, really? took a picture. Really? So, yeah. Really, no. Yeah, it will, really? yeah. So, yeah, just make sure you don't delete it. I mean, you said you're going to put me on YouTube. How are you going to do that if you haven't taken a picture? Well, I'll take a picture before when you leave. Okay. But again, so you're threatening to breach GDPR then, aren't you, Raj? That, that's what you're doing. You're just trying to put away this mouth. No, no, because if he puts me on YouTube while he's, wor no, while he's working, yeah, yeah. He's, he's acting yeah. under the he's organisation. Like, yeah. yeah. You need to stop recording me because I don't give okay. you permission to record me. <clears throat> okay. I don't, I don't give you permission to record me, so if, when you turn your cameras off in here, I'll, I'll turn mine off. Yeah, we're yeah. Gonna, like we're going to do that. Man. Exactly. You're, you're the queen or the king or something. Like exactly. So what, what, gives you the, what gives you the right to ask and not be recorded if I don't have that right? <laughs> it's funny, you know. Yeah, you yeah, think, we you think find you funny as well. Good. So, uh, both ways, mate. But yeah, so uh, just so I'm going to do a request for that uh, <laughs> photo that you took. So, all right, and uh, so your company will be asking for it at some point. Just, uh, nice. And you need to stop recording me. Oh, I'm sure you got my good side. There isn't one, sorry. <laughs> Cheers. You too. Yeah, there we go, guys. So. We'll get that one zoomed in in there. Got beautiful uh, Raj. So it says the use of recording equipment is not permitted, but yeah, they have QR codes up on the wall. I did miss the point that the bit there where it says appointments only, but it's still a public building, still paid for by the taxpayer. Um, and there's still information in there for the public to go and access at the end of the day. So. Uh, I walked around that way already, actually. Let's walk back up this way. Yeah, so there are more windows than that around here. But hopefully... You can't see any computer screens through them. As I said, in terms of other windows and stuff, they have done really well. You can see like the bottom three quarters are all frosted, so you can't see through them. Blinds are closed on those ones. But, uh, yeah, unfortunately, you can see computer screens through these windows. They're not on today, those ones. No, none of those ones are actually on today, so I suppose that's uh, not such a huge issue. Uh, maybe the way they got the blinds closed down the other end uh, of the computer screens that are on being used for appointments today. But yeah, huge, huge empty building. Barely anybody in there. Oh, there you go. So I can see that one computer screen through there. And I'll uh, just zoom in that in for reference. I will blur that out. 
Um, but yeah, just uh, so the DWP can see exactly how bad the GDPR breaches are. Not good at all. Nice little 125 motorbike over there. Very pretty. Mm. Actually, yeah, not so good with the GDPR from the windows on this side either. You can see uh, computer screens down there, one over there that that lady's working on. It's not good at all. Not good at all. So again, all of that will be blurred out. But yeah, you don't expect um, your personal information. Like they've got frosted glass up until like my neck height, so like my whole head is higher than the frosted area. So you can actually see all of the uh, information that the frosted bit is supposed to protect. It makes it completely pointless. And I'm not overly tall, guys. I'm only six foot. Yeah, I'll tell I'm about average for a guy of my age. But there we go. Yeah, Raj didn't like being on uh, camera there at all. But then... Don't work for the government. At the end of the day, you're a government official, you're up for public scrutiny. And there we go, so I'm going to move on to the next one, guys. Going to head up to Kempston area of Bedford now, to Kempston Police Station and Bedford Headquarters. Uh, I've done Bedford Headquarters before and I didn't have too much of an issue. Uh, Coley went there and had mad issues. So yeah, we're gonna see how they do on the second one. Um, and with the drone as well. So yeah, I'll see you then. Sarah.